It's the second game of three this week right here at BMO Field for Toronto FC. The third and final meeting of the regular season between TFC and Orlando City. Toronto losing just one of their last 11, although they've not won in the last three here at home. It's Alex Bono in goal again tonight. First of all, let's look at Orlando City as Joe Bendik is in goal for them. And a few changes made to their lineup as well. Yeah, there are a few changes. Obviously, they're matching up in that diamond midfield. The player to watch for is Kaká, of course. And how he matches up against Michael Bradley will be really interesting from Toronto FC's perspective. Brett Hong in the back keeps the back four consistent in midfield. There's been a change. Armando Cooper comes in on that left-hand side. Benoit Sheru drops out. And Tosaint Ricketts comes up up top alongside Josie Altador. Jordan Hamilton drops out of the lineup. Toronto FC. As Bowden comes down the left side, plays it back to Kakar. Kakar's cross taking a deflection towards Rebass at the back post. Now this is Brett Shea, who scored at Montreal a couple of weeks ago. Shea's ball in, comes all the way towards Lowen. What a save from Bono! Diving low to the right to deny the Canadian international, Kyle Lowen. So it's Michael Bradley to take this, and it's an outswinger over the head of Ricketts. Gets there in the end, and put it past the Canadian. Good delivery from Michael Bradley, and Tossaint Ricketts does really well to get to that near post space. Gets himself in a, a good area as well. He really has to hit the target there. He's got to head that down. Michael Bradley, and all of them have been stops. There's Osorio. Osorio into the path of Marky Delgado. Great chance for Marky Delgado! Flashing wide of the post. Good move from Toronto. I see great little flick with the back heel from Josie Altador. And Jonathan Osorio finds the space to get the ball to Marky Delgado. And there's Justin Morrow, the left back, pushed forward. Made to show once again down the line. Osorio with some space here. Altador making a run to the back post. Delgado in support to the right. Delgado finds Michael Bradley. He'll try and chip it through towards Josie Altador. Osorio was diving in. Great ball from Michael Bradley. Perfectly weighted, timed run for Josie Altador, who does really well just to cut this back. And there's Jonathan Osorio making that deep late run. He just tries to get over this. Comes a little bit too quickly for him. I think I'm catch him by surprise a little bit. it in towards Altidore, Josie Altidore, still going, good cross into the middle, and Tossaint Ricketts with a boot to the head of Aha. And the referee shows him a second yellow, it's a red card for Tossaint Ricketts. It's a good ball clipped in by Josie Altidore. I don't, I don't think there's any contact made at all. I think AHA makes a complete meal of this. Toss that rink, it goes for the bicycle kick. It's difficult to say on that angle. There could be some contact made. Difficult to tell again there. The last few seconds as Mateos knocks this one long downfield towards Baptista. Hagland wins it in the air, then Lovitz forward. It's full time at BMO Fields. Toronto FC gets a point against Orlando City, having been reduced to 10 men for the final 20 minutes. Toss St. Ricketts sent off in this one. It is a point that takes them back to the top of the East. Not all three, as Greg Vanny's men would have wanted. It finishes 0-0.